Hey, Greg, how are you? I'm doing all right. Thank you for joining us on Film Fiend. Uh, we want to talk to you about, uh, about your movie Smashed coming out. Yeah, yeah, please. When I saw the trailer for it and the line in there was, I think I ended up smoking crack last night or something like that, I knew this was a movie... I knew this was a movie that I had to see. Anything that has that line in it is a must see. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's just such an honest, uh, such an honest story, yeah. It's a pretty heavy, heavy journey that you're taking uh, with alcoholism and, I mean, it doesn't really pull any punches and you see the downward spiral, but then like a couple minutes later, you're, you're laughing, you know, at, at all of the things that are going on. It, it seems really balanced out in there. Yeah, that's what's so great about this film. You know, I mean, it, it, was, it's, it was that way on the page because if it was just nothing but severe drinking and just depression and people crying and, you know, peeing the bed and it just wouldn't be, um, it would just be too much, you know, but they break up that uh, intensity with, uh, just pure, honest humor. And uh, yeah, it's just, it's a great story of two young people in love just battling their, their own demons. Yeah, and it's, it's getting really good reviews. I mean, everywhere that I've read about it and, and everything that, that I've seen about it has been like, this is a movie that we hope more people will see because the writer and the director, he just basically, he took something and made it really real and didn't pull any punches with it. Exactly, that's what, you know, that's what made me want to fight for this this project. You know, it was just so unbelievably honest. It just seemed like, you know, James and Susan lived every moment of this story um, because everything was just real. Um, and so, yeah, I'm so happy that people are watching it and people are loving it. And um, what, you know, what Mary Elizabeth Winstead did with, uh, with Kate is just phenomenal. Um, just mind blowing. She just uh, had me in awe every day at work. When I was kind of looking up some stuff on you, I'm a big fan of, of Breaking Bad and just like your, your stuff on there. It's, that's an amazing show. One of the best shows on, on TV right now. But I found something that uh, I didn't know about and everyone else has probably already seen it, but they have clips of you being on Price is Right. And it was just, it was cracking me up. <laughs> it was like, well, they had like 35 reasons why we should be a fan of you. Oh yeah, I heard, yeah, I, I was sent that. Yeah, it's pretty, um, pretty funny. Yeah, one of the reasons was me uh, being on the, the Price Is Right. That was years ago, right after I started acting, and um, it was fantastic. Yeah, I got chosen. I got to spin the big giant wheel. I spun a ninety-five and went to the showcase showdown, and then I bid a hundred and thirty-two dollars over and lost everything. And I got to tell you, I was depressed for. You know, at least a, a few months afterwards. One of the reasons on there was that you got to touch Bob Barker, which, you know, that, that was an amazing <laughs> reason. Now, when you've got time, uh, you know, in your spare time, we have a question that we like to ask. Uh, is there a movie that you can watch over and over? Maybe it's a guilty pleasure, but just something. If it comes on, you have to watch it. Uh, Big Lebowski. Um, Goonies. God, Goonies. What an amazing movie that was. Goonies is actually one of my favorite movies. It really, you know, it's so good. And Stand By Me, you know, those, those films that I, I watched growing up that just kind of made me want to be an actor. I could just watch, any time they're on, I could just sit back and, and watch it. Yeah, it's just such fond memories. Aaron, we thank you so much for joining us on Film Fiend. We encourage everyone to go out and watch Smashed. We hope you have continued success. I appreciate it, bud. Thank you.